Welcome to mechanical tutorial. I am going to teach you different techniques in SOLIDWORKS for mechanical engineers. I am going to train you different modules like surface modeling, sheet metal and enclosure design, product design, plastic components design, reverse engineering and many more tips and tricks in SOLIDWORKS. Hi, today I am going to explain about profile center mate. I am going to explain the different geometries and also with an example. Let's start. Say I have uh, taken an assembly file and in inserted different uh, shapes of components. See when we see from the top view, see these are the different geometrical shapes triangle, trapezoidal, parallelogram, rectangle, hexagon, circle, pentagon, ellipse and square. So I am going to show you profile center mate with different geometrical features. So we have to go to mate, advanced mate. So here we need to select profile center. So here I am going to select this circular feature and hexagonal feature, see here. When I say OK, see, I am keeping in top view, it is exactly at the center. But one thing is that there is a rotation of this component. So to avoid rotation, there is an option lock rotation. So, when we say lock rotation does not rotate, see here. So, few more options I am going to explain. See here, we can assign a certain distance, see it is 10 mm. So, when I say okay, see here. and flip direction so we can alter the direction see here so i am going to suppress this now i am going to check with uh, pentagon see here profile center mate and I am going to select this and this sir. see when I keep it in top view see it is exactly at the center so I am going to undo I am going to check with the square and hexagon see here here see we have additional option that is orientation I will keep it in top view see here this orientation is going to change see here so you can change the orientation as per requirement So one more thing is that let us verify the what are the geometrical features are going to accept profile center mate. So when I select this and click this it is highlighting but when I clear this one and select this triangle so I am going to select once again advanced mate see when I select this triangle this profile center mate is not highlighted this profile does not accept profile center mate so triangle is not acceptable even ellipse see it is not highlighting so let us check with a trapezoidal 
see it is not highlighting profile center meet parallelogram so it is not highlighting so it is accepting only hexagon circle pentagon rectangle and square so what we have to do if it doesn't this profile doesn't accept so i'm going to show you with an example so i'm going to other assembly see here these are the two components so when i go to advanced mate and profile center mate if i select this and this face it is not selecting it's not able to select so i section we are not able to select see here the top side also it's not selecting so in that condition what we have to do is so i'm going to open this component see here i have created a sketch on the top plane so this is a simple rectangle sketch so i'm going to show you in the sketch mode see this is a simple rectangle so when we go to assembly we can see this sketch now i'm going to use this sketch for this profile center mate so i'm going to select this face and this sketch see here when i keep it in top view it is exactly at the center we can change the orientation also see here any orientation so if profile center mate is not accepting the any face then we have to create a sketch see here it is exactly center when we see from the top view so this is a brief about profile center mate which comes under advanced mate thanks for watching